Her windows do look dirty. Today we're going to be looking at our little 1974 Champion Titan Motorhome, also known as Yzma. Sorry about sorry about the traffic noise. We live on a busy street, but hopefully you can hear me. We bought Yzma this year. We've done a little bit of work to her. She still has a lot of work left to do. We thought we'd just go around and go over some of the things that we've done and some of the things we plan on doing with her. We got my wife here. Say hi. Hi. Alrighty, there we go. So the first thing we did on the outside is we went ahead and freshened up her paint lines, the, the blue, the dark blue lines around her. When we got it, it was... Oh. An awful metallic turquoise? Yes, it was flaking off and it wasn't very nice. It was, uh, she looked, she looked very, very rough. She still needs a good cleaning. There's still quite a bit of stuff to do on her outside, but... She's looking better every day. She is a dual fuel vehicle. She runs on both gas and propane. That's her big propane tank that she currently runs on as we uh, clean her, her fuel tanks. Those will probably our next project. Yzma is only 24 feet long, so she's not very big. We didn't pay very much for her either. What we did get out of her was almost new appliances on the inside. Some brand new appliances on the inside. Transmission. Transmission was just rebuilt. The engine was just gone over before we got her. Uh, quite a bit of stuff was wrong though. Nothing that was a deal breaker. She had a leak on the inside back here. On both sides it leaked down. We'll show you that on the inside here in a minute. She has a broken clasp right there, so it keeps her face open. And I guess this is a face you might say kind of looks like a derp. Is that about what you'd say? Yeah, I could say that. But really needs her windows cleaned. Yes, we had a rainstorm, and and where we live, it doesn't rain water; it rains white crap. So this is up the other side of her. Like I said, a, quite a bit of work has been done to her, both on the inside and the outside. She's got a fantastic generator on her back end. New tires on her. Those new tires are expensive. I'm glad she had them on when we bought it. Her awning does work. It's fairly new. Yzma's biggest problem was that she was sitting for way too long. So let's go ahead and open her up. She had good carpet. Not the perfect carpet, but good carpet, so we kept that for now. Might be something we change later on, but... You're going to show some before and afters, right? Yes, we, as we go through this, there will be before and after pictures spliced in that way. People kind of get an idea. It's kind of hot in here. It's very hot in here. All right, so we've kind of gone from the the back of the motorhome forward. 